like yeah. having a Nate yeah. playing bass on it, that was very special, you know. And then on this record, it's cool, we're gonna have uh, Arthur, which is the producer, he's also gonna help out with the bass. At the end of the day, it's it's always fun, you know, like having those guests, of course, there's a musical connection to it, and it's really cool, like, we still got to hang out with Nate every time we come to Boston, or he's around, Yeah. and same with Joe from Gojira, I saw him in France when I was doing some stuff with Mix Hell, he just popped in the dressing room, he was playing the same festival, which is like a crazy, and I was like, man, it's been a long time, so it, it's really cool. <laughs> She's gonna buy you a mockingbird. And if the mockingbird don't sing, she's gonna buy you a diamond ring. So that's what we're seeing, right? Lightning, fight in the aeons! Thunder, immortality, glorious! Question, blood of the new world! The zealots were the, in Jerusalem. They were the, they were pretty much the the killers of the Romans. They used to go out and kill Romans. So, That's awesome. And then the zealots' name got translated to Spanish, became sicarios. Sicarios come oh, from zealots I in Israel. Know. That's cool. So they did what what the sicarios do, going around killing people. They used to do that to the Romans. Only death. It'd be one, two, three, four, one. Only death is real. This way that the real is on the one of the one. Only death is real. That's it. That's the one? Yeah. Yeah. Excruciating hell. God's blood is shed. Excruciating, agonizing. Let the war be waged. This might look like your typical average trailer, but it's not. Inside are all the goodies from Max World. The metal shirts, the clothes, the recording equipment. I'm gonna bring some of those shirts inside the house and show you guys what we got in store for you. Uh, everybody knows me from the camouflage band since the late 80s. It's a funny story because in Brazil we couldn't buy military stuff, it was forbidden to buy military stuff. So the first time we went outside Brazil in 89, we went to Europe and I went to an army shop and I lost my fucking mind. I fucking lost it. I was like, no, I can't believe you can buy this stuff, you know. So I bought camouflage pants, star wear. This became my, my favorite color, the urban camo, black, white, and gray. But my mom always wanted to, to, to help me create stuff and she made me a, a pair of pants that I wear at the Donington and we call it Mulumbo pants. Mulumbo is like a bum a little bit similar, but like somebody that just doesn't give a fuck. So she made me that and I, I don't know what happened to the original Mulumbo pants, but I asked her to make me a, another one and she came up with one. It's not exactly how it was. This one is a little bit crazier, 
but she made me this and uh, made these things on the side that are really crazy looking. As you can see, this is a, a kind of a camouflage, a darker, darker kind of camouflage. But uh, yeah, my mom made this for me and uh, I put the patches on later on. And I, I wear this from tour to tour, I still wear it, I still love it when I'm not wearing those babies. And then there's the stuff that I do that I really like to do. This is one that I just made. It's a bunch of alchemy and kind of evil symbols actually, like crazy. This is the symbol of, of the guardian angel Saint Michael, which I think is really cool. And I just paint this right here, you know, before I go on tour. This one is my favorite vest that I've done forever. This is the original one. This is the, the prototype Max vest. It's got the Celtic Frost. It's got the band from Brazil, Test, that I love, Grindcore. It's got the Nails Wolf. The Anarchy symbol, Full of Hell. Calm Hatchery from Poland. Integrity and Hell Hammer. I put all the spikes myself. I put all the safety pins myself. And then in the back, I have a great motorhead. I love this motorhead symbol, it's fucking amazing. There's a gold whore. And fuck this shit. I found that in some shirt. And discharge, but discharge is almost fading. It's, I wash it so many times. All right, this is something very special. Well, we were on tour with Pantera back in the uh, mid 90s. It was Sepultura, Morbid Angel, Pantera. And uh, Dimebag knew it was my birthday. And he came to me and he like, hey Max, I found these pants. I know they're like new wave colors. Not really your type, but I thought it was cool because they're camouflage. I was thinking about you, brother. There you go, man. Those are your pants. I never wear them. But I put it away. They're, they're in a safe place. Dime bag thinking of me, thinking of my camouflage. He gave me those. Quite amazing, you know. It's so cool that musicians do that. Dime is such a... Such a cool guy, such an awesome dude, so awesome. Um, yeah, another musician knows that it's your birthday and gives you something like so meaningful like this. And uh, when I heard he passed away, you know, of course I went back to. I, mean, I remember the, the pants, and uh, it's in a real safe place now. It's a treasure now for me to have this. On tour, sometimes you create great bonds that last a lifetime. You know, that's that's one of the bonds we created with Dimebag on that tour. It was so sad to hear about what happened to him. And I just hope he's in a, in a better place, you know, and uh, I'll see you one day up there, brother. But thank you for the great pants, you know. I'll treasure this forever, man. Rest in peace, Dimebag, forever. Só fazer o começo do Double Bass. Ah, é? Qual que é a tentar uma? Vamos. Saiu. Só da Fox Real.
Yeah, I think it's pretty cool. Okay, it's now. the sweet one. World, a two-headed Brazilian Godzilla was born, destined to leave permanent sound scars on all under pale gray skies. Hell, chaos, pandemonium. Must have been nineteen. 84 and my guitar string broke the little the first one and we kept on jamming you know another day goes by the second string breaks down so I have this choice to be made I had a little bit of money that we got it from the people to send it from Europe to buy t-shirt I was the president of the fan club which was a horrible, horrible idea because I'm horrible with finances. <laughs> so I just cash all the money. So we had the little money, you know, band money bank situation. So my big dilemma was, do I buy a pack of strings? Or do I buy some vodka so we can play better tonight? So strings, alcohol, strings, alcohol, alcohol alcohol went to the store bought some booze fuck the strings i play with four strings from now on yeah. 